Just look at it. Oh my god. It's literally the power of the sun. Hey guys, it's Wolf of Valhalla Gaming, and we are back with Cliff Empire in Valhalla, Asgard, Midgard, Helheim, Jotunheim. But before we start, I'm going to need y'all to click that like button, hit that subscribe, and ring the bell. Uh, as you can see, I did a little bit of reconstruction. I moved the Beacon of Hope out of the center of our city and replaced it with a large park. Kind of? I like it. I don't know. I think it's kind of cool. And I kind of like the description Any under the Spartan. Completed. And we have moved the Beacon of Hope over here. Somebody commented that it looks really good where I had the uh, United Bank. So I went ahead and moved it over here. And then I believe the same person commented that I messed up the roads up here and they weren't connecting properly. And as you can see, other than this little glitch right here where the texture isn't loaded in, the streets are now fixed. So yes, I do read your comments. You are not going unnoticed, I promise. Anyway, today's goal is obviously uh, try and finish the Beacon of Hope. We need about another 1,700 batteries, 1,600 batteries, and another $200,000. So this may take a while. Um, I don't know what our exact... What is our, like, daily... So, by this rate, we should only have to spend another year. Oh boy, a year until we can build this? That's rough. But, luckily for us, we're also building one here. And that one only needs matter. And we're building one here. Oh, that was asleep. And that one only needs matter. And we're building one here and it only needs trading plan everything but it's kind of a race to see which one gets done first uh one two and three have the money and they're just waiting on materials man power here took a hit because i kind of destroyed a lot of housing as you can see um a lot of the cities are going to get reorganized completely now that i have the ability of making these so clearly you know once this place is done we should be buying matter actually where's my matter production at oh my our matter mine was destroyed during an earthquake i did a little bit of off-screen gameplay i'm sorry so there was an earthquake it destroyed some stuff and i'm still rebuilding i didn't realize that it had destroyed our matter mine which is severely hindering our abilities here it also destroyed our Trading airport by the looks of it those bastards so once that gets done we should be able to at least get some more stuff um, yeah we're buying matter every day we're also should be turning debris yeah we're still turning debris into matter but it is nice to have an actual matter mine um, even though we only get like 50% matter so I mean regardless but we need that matter. Our energy here is pretty good though for uh, nighttime or daytime. Nighttime it takes a big hit. But thankfully, once this building is built, it produces a thousand energy, and we won't need like any energy production facilities here except that. Um, Trading platform arrived. New Asgard is the only one that really comes close to needing enough energy production to have to use this plus some other facilities but Huge I figure it's nothing completed. some on the wall stuff can't handle like we already have some on the wall and uh, I think that'll be fine hop over to Jotunheim only another 1400 batteries left to go guys Yes, I have realized there's a drought going on. I just don't care. Um, manpower up here is actually stabilized, right around 98%. Trading platform arrived. Yeah, I don't see any Trading issue to mess with up completed. here. Um, if anything, I would just like to start sending people back from the 
main three cities and make them very small because small construction um, completed. I would just like to really downsize these cities and just improve their um, economic and social well-being, I guess would be the words. I would also kind of like to knock this docking station down. Oh no, I put this bridge in the worst spot ever. Because in order for me to put... I really like railroads. Um, don't get me wrong, I like bridges too. Um, I just think the railroads look better. If we go over to Small the construction subways, yeah. Completed. It can carry 70 passengers. Large so. construction completed. Large construction completed. And... Tiny construction completed. They can move to neighboring cities. Trading Why have I never arrived. realized that? Can my... Does the bridge allow... Okay, so yeah. This does the exact same thing. But I, I really like the way the subway looks. I think it's a little bit more necessary. Especially on... I wouldn't say it's necessary. Um, clearly there's a pipeline. There's a power grid. So the only thing we really trade is like food, fish, and all this stuff. And we don't even really trade food that much. I'm pretty sure we're completely like self-sustained on food. Why are you not fully upgraded? Oh, you are. Why are you? You can only hold a hundred food fully upgraded. Oh, that's, Trading that's ridiculous. Okay. Well, now I know that this only holds a hundred food upgraded. But if we go over here, we're making a little bit more food than we need per day. But I think that's because we're selling if we have more than a hundred, or we're buying if we have less than a hundred. Oh, that's right. Our food took a massive hit. Our food here did take a large hit. I um, knocked down a lot of our food production area so I could build this behemoth. And now we really just need matter to go to it. So I mean, it, it should be priority one for matter. Objective yeah, we'll pay that fine. I don't really care. I wonder if we pay that fine, but did it just go to Valhalla? Did I like still kind of just equalize my economy half and half? How much power does this take whenever it's not it's like 40 kilowatts without it being turned on. Trading platform. Oh my. That's, that's a solid 40 kilowatts with it being put to sleep. That's a lot of energy. Tiny What's happening over in Jotunheim? Oh, we don't have water. We never have Tiny water. Why do we never have water here? Tiny construction oh my. Completed. It's got to be because of all the fields, right? The fields Tiny automatically get water completed. because of some of my researches. Um... Yeah, so we auto-deliver that. So what is our food? Because we don't need all this food. Those are mo mainly for looks. And we're producing positive one per day. Are we really only producing? No, we're not. Look how much food we have. We have 900 and... Hmm. So we can put like... Large construction completed. We can honestly Trading probably put this entire wide. large one to sleep. And just take food from these smaller ones, and that'll probably help our water production. Because we just don't have enough water here to uh, facilitate growth of so many fields. Even though I have so many water plants. So many. So many water plants. And they work at like almost 100% efficiency. What is it? Uh, oh, 108% efficiency. Very well. Also, we lost a lot of money. How did we lose so much money? What did we... Oh, there's stuff under construction. Was there another one of these built? Yep. These two guys got built. Okay, so we just lost a lot of progress. I don't like that. But it is what it Trading is. Platform. On the bright side, you land and you're in front of these massive statues that are kind of like guarding the heart of the city. And it's kind of pretty. Not gonna lie, I kind of like how this turned out. Um, clearly, I'm gonna redesign this entire city as well. I don't really like the super modern housing, and I just feel there's not a need for it. Like, we have a lot of workplaces, yeah, but almost all of them live in our historic block over here that we designed. I did put some fountains and some stuff in the historic block as well, just to kind of uh, stimulate a economic growth, I guess. 
English, sure. And then clearly we still have the Notre Dame. Um, power here is going to be kind of rough. We may need two beacons Trading of hope, Blackburn not going to lie. We may need two down the road, but that's, that's for another day. Um, like I said, we still have a long way to go until we even get a single beacon of hope, because I think Val, not Valhalla, New Asgard. I think New Asgard is the closest to a beacon of hope. And it still requires a massive amount of matter that is being produced constantly right here. And it's just a constant battle. And then, do 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 do, that's not what I wanted. I want my airport. Airport's kind of hidden away down here. Uh, we can get another one of these and one of these. So we're just going to start doing that. Did my airport over here get built? Yeah. Oh, it did. There we go. How many are we missing? One, two, three, and two of these. You have to keep checking on your drones. They get shot down pretty often. Where's my airport over here? Oh, I was going to put my beacon of hope right here, but I think it was too large or something. I can't remember. I can't remember why I wasn't going to put the beacon of hope right here. I legitimately cannot remember, because it would have fit just fine. Not sure. But I kind of like putting the Beacon of Hope over here by the industrial side of the place. Um, not sure why we have that put to sleep. That was producing a lot of our materials. Uh, probably just accidentally clicked on it. Oh, as you can see, I also destroyed our little, uh, our landy boy, where they land. And they land over here now in the city. So you land a lot closer to where you're going to immigrate to, and then your jobs are all down here, along with like your fire department, your nuclear generators Trading that are going to get knocked well. down as soon as this guy's done. Oh my, you have no engines. Do we even have engines for sale? Can we start buying if we have less than like 50, and we'll just give them all to this? That's probably what's about to have to start happening. Okay. Let's hop over to Jotunheim. We already got a lot of our money back because Jotunheim is a money-producing monster. We produce a good amount of money per day. I mean, if we clear all of it, I know we buy a lot of things. Our food is going down. Which isn't good because I was hoping we had enough fields to just kind of stabilize. But our water is going up a lot, so we could open another field or two. Um... Actually, our food is going up, so I don't know. It goes in waves, I guess. Tiny construction completed. Stop building stuff. We need the Trading money. Arrived. Gods. They really like building a lot of stuff here. I kind of want to put all these to sleep first and let the other ones get built, but I mean, this one's already so close. Look at it. We almost have our beacon of hope here, and then I can knock all of this stuff down and reorient everything, and it's going to be so pretty. It's gonna be so pretty, guys. So, so pretty. And then we can knock down all these nuclear reactors. And I don't think we really have too many power production facilities other than these, like, wind turbines. I do want to keep the industrial down here, but I do want to build, like, a large uh, agricultural and kind of scatter some of these buildings. I don't know. I kind of want to go for, like, a Roman look, honestly. I like the way these look, but I think it would look nice. I don't know. Let me know. Should we do each city with, like, a specific design? Like, we could do a Roman look, like, an older look, and, like, a super modern city. Um, Jotunheim already has an historic district, so I feel like if we just kept going with, like, the academy-style buildings... How many academies can we build? We still have another, like could also do a grand hotel um and some epic fountains like we don't need this whole sector over here i mean it's super pretty and i love having like our super industrial tech center like you know walking my way downtown people are weird and i'm not really homebound but you know like, i really like our little central park that we have here our little fountain in the middle like he's so cute look at it the horse and then you come down here and it's just, it kind of continues, but it's nice. It kind of has like that New York vibe, minus the, this being, you know, like, gigantic. 
And then down here you have like your historic housing. So I may knock all of this housing down and do more city blocks like this. Because I did figure out how to make this housing look so much better. So much better, like you have no idea. So I may knock all of this housing down. Because each one of these holds, I think, like 13 tenants. Which is fine. Like, like I said, we, we're really good on our numbers right now. And this only holds 20, so... If we expanded that Trading historic district right. throughout this entire area and just knocked down everything else and kind of moved everything else around the historic area and turned mm -hmm. that entire mm -hmm. middle into the historic area, I think it'd look really nice. Um, I think, yeah, just many days of thunderstorms. Not really a big issue. Again, um, we're only 900 batteries away. I still think New Asgard is the closest one to finishing theirs, though. They're only about a thousand matter away. Holy crap, that person Ooh, just died. Oh. Ooh, so I was just, I was also reading the Reddit about, like, population, and apparently population growth just kind of sucks. Like, in these games, or this game specifically, um, population growth is just kind of hard to get. Like, even if you stimulate the birth and turned off all of the... All of the, uh, the, 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 oh, I can't add English right now. Uh, if you turned off natural disasters and only let people die from old age, even then, it would take so many hours of gameplay to actually, like, see, people only really die here from 195, oh my, they're busy up on the space station. Um, old age and diseases here, Nobody sure. We hop over to Asgard. Which is probably our oldest fire. city. And it's not a probably in there, it is our oldest city. And we just look at a hospital. We've got 375 people born. That's not bad. Um, I mean, I'm pretty sure we landed like 100 years ago, so that's kind of shitty. But, um, old age, disasters, diseases, and fires. Fires kill so many people. And it kind of. It kind of bugs me. I did not know my G keys switched my cities for me. Okay, sorry, I just found out a mechanic of my keyboard in the game that I didn't know about, and it was quite interesting. So yeah, I'm not really sure what to do. I would also like to reorganize this stuff down here. I've realized that nothing kind of like impacts this bottom area, and would like to have put like my satellite array kind of like right here. and kind of built like a big satellite ray that faces itself kind of like that building is on fire. I guess building is on fire. if that makes sense I I know I'm probably speaking gibberish but if we did like one right here and one like come on come on like right there uh, like right there and they would kind of like touch each other and make like a big satellite dish kind of pointing upwards. Kind of like the um, satellite dish and I forget where it's at. Uh, I think it's South America where it's like dug into the side of a mountain. Really big, really pretty. There was a battlefield map built Building after it. Um, we have more workplaces Building than we have people, fire. so we're just going to go ahead and demolish more building. building um, what do we have too much of that we don't really need anymore? I don't know. How's our uranium? Well, we need uranium here, unfortunately, building for now. Um, what we do not need... 87. How many... 25. So if we got rid of... 50 jobs? I don't care. We have enough... We have enough to put fires out, so stop killing my people. Um, how's our medical looking? Oh, our medical is way high now, so we don't really need these medical colleges anymore, do we? I don't really like the medical colleges anyway. They they look kind of funny to me. I mean, they do they add a lot both to medicine and to everything else. But I mean, uh, if we demolish this one, that's 20 workers, and our manpower hits 100%, and we still have enough medical. Yep. 
So we're good on that. So I'm thinking either we do like, since the historic housing, like these housing blocks, um, since they're so small, or not so small, but they hold so few people, maybe do these cities with like the historic housing. And obviously, and oh, what is Jotunheim missing? Food, we don't have enough food. Oh no. See, I was worried about that. We underproduced food. And now we need to open up some of these farms again. And start collecting our food back. That's cool. I love when that happens, don't you? I just love it. And then our manpower is already at 80% because population gets sick because we don't have enough food. Meh. I love this game. Absolutely love it. I just wish there was a way to, like... On wall construction completed. Well, I know there is a way to kind of... Was that in here? Please tell me that wasn't here. Building I'm tired of wasting fire. money here. I think that was Building here. Is on fire. I don't know. Anyway, is you can see fire. our food slowly going back up, which is going to push our manpower back up. Our manpower might actually hit 100. Is our manpower going to hit 100, fire. even though we have we have enough energy? Is on oh, no, we don't. We have, nine, we have 90% energy. Okay. Well, why is our energy required so high? God, that's rough. You need to hurry up. You need... Oh, it's because we have thunderstorm. We don't have any solar. That's why our energy is so low. Oh no, our food. Our food is cycling back down. That's not good. That's rough. I don't really like prioritizing food anymore. I know it's important, but the drones are... We just have so many drones here that I don't think it's necessary to prioritize food. Are we losing drones? I mean, we've lost three and two. That's not really enough to impact. But I mean, since the airport is here, why don't I just do... Where are you at? Drone stations. I mean, it would make sense that the airport had drone stations, right? Like, that that's a thing. And we could very easily get enough material there to build those really quick, and they're only 4,000, so I don't care if we spend that much money. But those drones would also allow us to... That's another Medium construction completed. 12 drones that carry quite a large amount of things. Medium construction completed. And it fits quite nicely here. Honestly, I could take this portal, put it here, get rid of this one, and uh, Objective completed. just do some more stuff. But Building now that we're done with that awful, awful people storm, the city. people are going to start leaving the city. That's fine. Uh, we just need food. And I guess I'll just prioritize our food growth because that just seems to be the Trading way it goes sometimes, you know? It kind of sucks, and I kind of hate that it does that. But food growth is what it is, and we need food to be a healthy civilization here. Even though we're growing wheat in the snow, and I don't think that's ever once been an actual thing. But, you know, whatever. Um, this game's gonna do its own thing. Did that blimp just come out of the mountain? I'm not questioning physics anymore. Alright, so we should have enough food. We have enough water. It's finding a balance, I guess. So we need enough food here. Which, our food does shoot up whenever they harvest. It's just getting enough food to be constant, I suppose. So we do need maybe another two of these opened up, and they'll start producing uh, our manpower is down, which is unfortunate, but that's mainly because we have the 20% effect from our food being so low right now. But as our food shoots back up... Completed. Okay. So yeah, as our food shoots back up, our manpower shoots back up, which means people are going to want to come back here. Um, our food is dropping again. But all of our drones are collecting it. And it should stay pretty constant in this relative... I'm going to have to unsleep more of these fields, aren't I? I wish it was just like this field feeds this many people instead of this. I think that'd be a lot nicer. Because instead I'm trying to figure out like Trading how many crops do I need open to actually produce enough food now. And it's kind of... I'm not going to say stupid, it's the way the game mechanic is built, clearly. 
and if that's the way the developers meant for the game to be played, then that's how they meant for it to be played, but I suck at math, so this whole, like, this develops 30, whatever, 20 every so often is not for me, because I, I can't math. So, let's see, we're at $107,000 here, so we need another, uh 200 and something thousand, cool. Let's hop over to New Asgard, see how close we are to this one. This one's getting there. Uh, it needs nine, eight hundred more. This one needs probably a lot. Oof. And you probably need a good amount too, don't you? Yeah, you still need quite a lot. So it's between New Asgard getting enough matter, which is almost nine hundred more matter, or Jotunheim getting another hundred and fifty thousand dollars. We just lend them $150,000. I mean, they can repay it later, right? I mean, they're already at $111,000. Where's my bank at? 312 a day. City management. Issue a loan. Yeah, I don't think... If I issue the loan, it's only going to be for like the 2500 which is just not enough, really. Anyway... Since we're going to be in here and we're going to be redesigning all of this anyway, might as well... Do we need this courthouse? We do not need that courthouse. We're going to start building our new Trading historic district here. So we're just going to go some of our normal block houses here. And I'm going to show you all how these were kind of meant to be done. So each one of these is 13 people. So realistically, if I was going to add what one two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven but there's three i'm just gonna do this the other way four five Seven. So there'd be 14. So what's 14 times 13? I don't know. I'm bad at math. So we're going to ask my Trading best friend, one. Google. What is 14 times 13? The answer is 182. Cool, 182. Completed. We've been answered. Okay, 182, which means 1, 2, 3, 4, 5... So if I destroy this and build this, it almost evens out perfectly. So we're just going to knock all these down. Boom. Gone. And we're just going to start building some city blocks right quick. Oh, that was aggressive. And then we just flip them around like this. And we do it like this. People leaving the city. That's fine. Let them leave. I don't care. And then I know we're not going to get enough matter immediately off the bat. Trading platform arrived. Just because a lot of these, uh... There we go. A lot of the matter I have right now only goes to the big guy over here. Especially with what he's at. But this is going to kind of make it even, too. Between all the matter and stuff that we got going on. What is my matter deposits here. Not high enough to be doing this. People leaving the so city. honestly, if I wanted matter from here, small I would have to build another. Completed. Okay, there we go. So we've got another small construction completed. Uh, ideally, this one goes up. Oh, I didn't even put the two behind it. Jeez. Let's do these two. I need these two. People leaving the Priority city. them. Look, your housing is being built. Stop leaving. I promise, I'm building you new houses, and they're ancient looking, but they're so cute. Look at them. You can sit out on your balcony and enjoy dinner Trading while platform. drones harvest food in front of you. Oh boy. I might do the tall ones, actually. I kind of like the way these People look. The city. I like the tall boys. Kind of give it a little bit of variety, you know? And it's going to create, like, a little bitty courtyard in the middle here. Um... Not really, like, the same size Small as the other one, completed. but that is what it is. And then we do this, and it's still not tall enough. Why don't they have a tall corner? That kind of irks me that they don't have a tall corner. Like, that's as tall as it gets, which only matches up with the short one. 
Which is whatever, I guess, if we did do the short one. Then it's whatever. I don't really care. So we're gonna do some Keep lines of historic housing, because this is, like I said, 13 tenants Trading per row, and this is one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. So one of Small these is 186 completed. people. Thank you, Google. Turn my phone off before she talks back to me again. So that's 186 people. We only need Small construction maybe like completed. three rows of these. I don't know. What's We have 800 workplaces. So what's 800 divided by... We're going back to my Small calculator, but I'm not going to talk to her. Eight. That's 200. 800 divided by 186 means we would need four of these rows built, which I think would look nice if we kind of just spread them out. Um, this is a test row. I think in the end, it doesn't even matter because I tried so hard. No, I'm kidding. Um, in the end, I'll probably build them. Trading platform arrived. Ooh, we could probably do them right here, actually, where the old business district was and then move the business district over here. I don't know. Uh, we got a snowstorm, sell gadgets to the orbital station, orbital station can eat my butt, because I don't care about the orbital station, I care about finishing Small this, Jotunheim, you need $130,000, but yeah, I figure it's easier to do them that way than this way, because this way they kind of look all wonky, and uh, even if I did it like this, and then maybe like 180'd it, you see, it's still kind of just wonky looking. I wonder how that would look tall. Yeah. So you see, even if you do that... So, if the developers care... Trading platform arrived. Um, suggestion would be maybe more modular housing that connects easier. Maybe it kind of snaps to the other piece... That would be something I would like to see. I know they're constantly doing updates and mods and new testing Small things. Like we have the matter completed. auto storage with new trees and then we have uh, producing matter which just kind of, oh yeah, that's why I don't do the mods. But this has trees and I kind of like it. So we may get rid of our, I don't know how much it produces though. So we're gonna knock this building down. Our manpower is kind of low, but that's just because we're taking a 20% hit on efficiency currently, because my... Oh, no, no. Okay. So it's slightly larger than a normal matter mine. So we'll knock down two of our matter mines. Trading because we're buying matter from the orbital station anyway. Small construction complete. We're buying matter from the station anyway. See, we're getting our citizens back. Wall construction um, completed. Once this one gets done, I can show you. Oh, we can do the corner right here. So you come over here and you just select your corner. You got to find the one that's going to bend the right way. And then you do that. And then you do that. And look at that. Small construction now you have completed. a historic block. And you can kind of just walk through the middle of it. And it's kind of like Bourbon Street. And, except it doesn't smell like pee and poop and vomit everywhere. And, I love my home. Don't y'all love New Orleans? Arrived. Great place to go. I don't recommend it at all. Do not do it. Small okay. construction. Beautiful completed. place. Just don't go there on Mardi Gras. It's awful. And then you do Trading another corner here. Arrived. Oh, that's the wrong corner. That's what I meant. And if you even wanted to get fancy, you could do like these little... These, but these don't really fit anything, which is what irks me. Is like, they don't match up to that. And they're skinnier, so I, if I did the tall, skinny one, it would fit, I guess. But it, it's such a tall, like, it just doesn't fit, New like, height-wise, if that makes sense. So I, I kind of like just doing the regular corners. That's the wrong corner. There we go. So we've got almost all of our housing built. We're going to get all of our people coming back. Um, this is the last house to be built. We're gonna build a new matter mine here. We're gonna build a test mine. Okay, could you never do that again, please? And then does it? Trading it only requires five matter, just like a normal mine. And how much does it require to build? A hundred credits. I think that's less than a normal mine. A uh, normal matter Small mine requires. 
I have no idea. Huge construction completed. I apologize. My dog decided to drop his deer antler. So this produces at 56% efficiency, but it looks so much nicer than the normal matter mines, doesn't it? And it looks like you could build on top of it. Maybe that's why it glitches out. Could I put like, you can. So that's why it glitches out because they're meant to be stacked, if that makes sense. Like if I wanted to put a park up here or something smaller, maybe like a, a garden. See, you can 100% stack stuff on top of these, and that's why. Trading platform. That's why they freak out whenever you do the whole like putting them down because they want to stack. Okay, that kind of makes sense now. Maybe that's why they're tested because you could do that realistically, and then maybe take a. Uh, I think these are going to be way too big, but I'm going to try one. A modules foundation. See, yeah. Uh, unfortunately. This little roof covering doesn't cover the entire thing. We're gonna knock that one down. We're just doing some experimenting now while we wait, honestly. So let's do... Produces matter. Okay, so this one... Could you not? Thank you. Nope, nope, nope. Nope, 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 nope. It looks like it's just the regular... Oh, God. Okay. I apologize. I, uh, epilepsy. Oh, God, that was awful. Trading Jotunheim, why are you upset? What's wrong? Not enough food? I swear easy. to the gods, I'm going to lose my mind with you. You never have enough food or water or... You just can't be happy. These people can't be happy. I hate them. I give them everything. Literally everything. Like, I would kill to live in a city like this. Maybe not with the snow. I don't like the snow, but... Could you you just imagine waking up in your house and... Okay, we're in the historic district, but whatever. Yeah, like, waking up and this is what you see. Like, that is gorgeous. These people just hate... Why did New Asgard just have four grand stolen from it? Holy crap. Uh, we don't have enough justice. That's kind of saddening. I guess we can throw down a courthouse or something. We have unemployment, so we can do a courthouse. How much justice do we need? We need like 12. How much do you add? 16? People leaving Are you a the city. town hall? How much does a court add? 30 justice per courthouse. I need to add some more courthouses. I didn't even realize that's how much they added. And they don't even really require too much, do they? 10 workplaces. That's not bad at all. We could build two of these and have more than enough justice for this city. And just priority one them really quick. Speaking of priority one, how's the matter looking? Another five, six, seven, Medium seven hundred. Yeah, okay, we're just gonna pay that. Fine. Jotunheim. Objective failed. Get your food. Was it because it was cold? Do crops not grow when it's cold outside? I forget. Cliff effect. Yeah, we should be at a hundred percent on the cliff effect here. So now it's just manpower Trading that we're losing. Life. People leaving the city. Um, which really, that'll Medium fix itself again, like completed. I said. Uh, once that cliff effect comes, yeah, there's all the food. So the food's gonna bounce right back up now. And these people are gonna be happy again, and they're just gonna make me mad because they like doing this whole, like, I'm not happy, I'm happy, I'm not happy. Like, shut up. New citizens but, realistically speaking, if I wanted to destroy this historic block, I could do a... another row of houses right here. Destroy this one. Another row of houses right here. Hmm, and maybe like a walkway in the middle, because there's like three in the middle. Okay, so we're going to do a test run with this historic district, because I really don't like how the historic districts turned out, honestly, because they're just all kind of cattywampus. So we're going to demolish you. And demolish you. And people are going to get upset because their houses are gone, and I don't care. That's fine. We're going to do that. We're gonna see just how quickly we can do something like this. And we're gonna build a historic city block. Just like this. To match the other one. Yeah. So we'll do this one. Then we'll do this one. Oh, God, that's gonna drive me nuts. Okay, so we're gonna need to knock down this entire row. I take that back. 
That's okay. Leave the city. I don't care. Your tears mean nothing to me. I'm your overlord. Alright. So from there, and then we rotate you. No, do not demolish. They do not demolish. We turn that into that. Trading platform we're going to add more housing than we're actually taking People away, though. So, I mean, overall, it's not a bad thing. We're literally doubling the amount of houses that we took away. So we can just get all this matter knocked out and then build our historic houses back. That'd be nice. And then I like putting this, like, courtyard thingy in the middle because then you can kind of, like, the eat city. dinner right there. I think that's a nice addition. Oh, we could do it all the way out, too, like that. Perfect. What do you know? It's like I planned it or something. I didn't really plan it. Shh, don't tell anybody. Alright, so we priority won all these. I know they cost a thousand. Um, it's unfortunate. It really city. is. I haven't even checked on our freaking other thingy. Small Does it even need matter? Completed. I don't think it needed matter. It just needed Small batteries and money, right? Completed. So, all of our matter can go here. Alright, so we've got... People leaving the city. You are going to turn into the short, no. Small construction so we do... Small construction no, completed. we do you. And then we do... Small construction no, completed. we do... No. Small construction no. completed. There we go. Maybe? New citizens arrived. And then you 180 these. There we go. Figured it out. So all of these get 180. That's cool. I don't know why I'm doing the 90 degree one when I could just be 180ing. Alright, so all these New are priority one. Arrived. That's gonna fix our housing. Small kind construction of completed. Whatever. Not really my problem. Small construction completed. Minorly my problem. Trading platform. But that's gonna arrived. build enough housing for everyone to come Small back so they can just kinda completed. shut up. So we're just Small 180 everything completed. here and it'll all fit. Small construction. See, there completed. we go. Everything fits now. And then we're gonna once these two get finished, that needs matter and that needs one matter, so like I said, not a big deal. And then we'll just put Small our corner pieces completed. on here, like no. Yes. New citizens are No. Yes. And Small then you just construction kind of 180 him, and there you go. We have a new historic city block. And I know... I uh, apologize. I know it's not as pretty as the other one. Like, it doesn't have all the stuff in the middle. But I think it just blends with itself new so much more. Alive. And then, honestly... Knock Trading all this stuff down. down. Knock that down. <laughs> Go ahead and knock this down, too. <laughs> Why are these not connected? That's gonna bug me. We're just gonna be doing a whole lot of, like, deconstruct over here. We're just destroying everything we've built for, like, the past how many episodes? I don't know. I love my life, don't y'all? So we do this. We do that. Just to have a road there. And then you do a large parkway. New citizens arrive. Oh, that park is like one off. Mm -hmm. That's gonna drive me up a wall. But whatever. Knock this one down. Knock this down. Build another one here. And then you can kind of continue this all the way down. Trading platform. I'm gonna now. knock that hospital down because I hate my citizens and we're just kind of. We're trying to make things look nice right now, okay? Don't judge me. How much further does that need to go? Uh, all the way up to this one. Lovely. And then you put another large park right here. Perfect. And then this road's gonna get destroyed anyway. It's not connecting to this road for some reason. Don't really know why. Um, we still don't have enough money, and it doesn't help that I'm constantly building. What about Valhalla? Or not Valhalla, New Asgard. What are you up to, New Asgard? You got a big power supply. How are you looking? We only need 500 more matter, so I'm getting real close to the end of this video. I don't want to leave y'all hanging any more than I want to be hanging.
Alright guys, we're back. Um, super unfortunate with this power situation because there's the mist. We're not going to make enough money. So we're going to do this. Oh, hello. I wanted a beacon of hope for my people by the end of the year. This is how we're starting our new year here. So they're getting their beacon of hope. Like it or not, somebody's getting a beacon of hope. And Objective holy completed. crap, there it is. We finished the beacon of hope. We done did it. We don't have any more objectives. That's it. That's 30 out of 30. But now that we're here, um, Midgard has like... Trading platform arrived. Oh, we have 410,000 still, I think. Yeah, that's, that's a comp. There should be a comp. So, what I want to do, I don't know, here's New Asgard, yeah, we're at like 29,000, but that's not going to be an issue because we have enough power to power our universe now. So we're going to demolish these uh, nuclear power plants, we're going clean. Clean energy only. But we are going to hop over to Midgard. And I know $70,000 seems like a big loan. But we're not getting one. We're getting two beacons of hopes today. So we are going to issue a loan to Jotunheim. I wonder how big of a loan it'll let me give. 50, 60, 70,000. And we're going to, before we lose that money, boom. And I know we owe like $67,000, but we have so much power now that we'll be able to finish. Oh, there's the fireworks too. Happy New Year's to our city. Look at it. I know it's covered in mist and it's kind of crappy. But oh my. I love the celebration. How's New Asgard look celebrating? Oh, it's. Are they not celebrating anymore? Okay, so we have like no money right now. As soon as uh, the mist is over, which is only three more days, we'll be good. And I've started completely rebuilding all of this. Um, it was literally like, you see that little gap right there? It was off Trading over here. Alive. So I've just start, I'm just going to rebuild all of this and shift it over left. And then we're going to rebuild the rest of the city based on that. Because um, I didn't realize these produce income as well. So with those producing income, this all producing income, this being... Ooh, you're a heckin' chunky boy. I wonder, could you technically build two of these in an X pattern? Because they don't intersect in the middle. You see how they don't have a thing in the middle? That's something for me to test on another day. But we're starting to build some money coming back so we're already going to start paying our loan off so let's hop over here because you can pay like 2500 off yeah so we're going to start paying off the loan as soon as we can we got power we got our beacons of hope oh, i'm so happy look at it just look at it oh my god it's literally the power of the sun look at those sparks coming off of it oh i'm so happy so so happy and then we're going to rebuild our historic district with these newer designs. We're going to put the Notre Dame back here. It's just going to be one block over. And then we're probably going to reorientate the entire city to face this way. Um, clearly, our... Yes, worship the beacon of hope. No, clearly our um, garden right here, I would like to turn it left and have like, you walk through this giant garden and then you get to Notre Dame and the historic district and the historic district's kind of gonna wrap around it. And then I'm gonna move all of our parliament and all of these other Treaty buildings, Black like our Black. justice production and all of that. It's gonna come up here. And we're gonna have some fun with this city now because we don't need, I mean, we need all these people living here, but we can move all of these people that are in these skyscrapers these block houses and these block houses produce income so it'll be a win-win for everyone it's gonna be a great time 
um, as soon as this mist goes away, we're going to see what our actual power levels are during a normal day. But there we go, we already have another two parts of that loan to pay off, so we're not incurring too much debt. Objective completed. We're paying it again, so there we go, we're going to get that reward, and holy crap. There's our power levels, ladies and germs. Now, I'm not curious, could we build another one? I mean, technically... Trading platform arrived. But that's what I would like. That looks like a Mac gun, first of all. Like, if any of y'all know Halo, you know what the Mac cannon is. Anyway, thank y'all for joining me. That looks gorgeous. And as always, I'll see you next time. Bye, guys. Thank you.